Welcome to the Power Archiver tutorial. Today we'll show you some new enterprise features available in the brand new Power Archiver 2012. One of them is a password profiles function which stores your passwords in a profile so that you can encrypt or decrypt your files much faster. Um, let's see how that works. Let's go to configuration, security, uh, password manager, and then you'll see the password profiles tab. To add a new profile, we'll click on Add, give it a profile name, and then we'll be asked to uh, enter our profile password, given the password policy requirements that we've uh, set previously. So we'll need five characters with one lowercase, one uppercase, and a uh, numerical character as well. So let's do that. And there we go, Power Archiver will let us know when the password policies are met. We'll click OK, we'll re-enter that. There we go. Now our profile is set. Now to see how that works, we'll go ahead and create a new archive. All right, we'll call it Test Archive. Click OK, and now we have our add window here, uh, encryption enabled. So we'll add a couple files to our archive here, click Add, and now in the Enter Password screen, we have a little drop-down option here that we can press and select the profile that we've created. Password is entered, click OK, and there we go. Our encrypted um, archive has been created with the password set in that profile. So now how decryption works, uh, we'll right-click it, extract to folder name extraction uh, window comes up and the password profiles option again appears we'll click the drop down menu select our profile click OK and there we go we've encrypted and decrypted our archive using the profiles without having to enter the uh, password so many times Thanks for watching and uh, take a look at our other tutorial videos. Thank you.